Hello everybody, welcome back for another episode of the of SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom. I almost said something weird, but never mind. Anyway, uh yeah, we're gonna be heading off to more of SpongeBob's dream. Uh let's see, let's break. Why not? There's nothing on the path anyway, I'm pretty sure. Like if there was like a sock there, I would do it. So yeah, see how I had to spend a thousand shiny objects just to continue? You have to do that for every single dream level. Now, I'm willing to wager that they want you to say no at first, just so that you can get the shiny objects in the level. But, honestly, th there, there's no freaking excuse, because literally the level's not designed for you to do it that way. So, like, I don't know, also this... There, that checkpoint thing didn't go off for the absolute dumbest of reasons. Actually, you know what, I'm gonna do this first. Just so I get it over with. Alright, or kill myself. Fuck it. You almost saw SpongeBob's butt. Anyway, uh... Yeah, my, my, my commentary is probably gonna be deterior. Fucking... 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 This reminds me so much of the last level in Mario Sunshine, but, you know... Whatever, so I'm gonna get that and probably gonna spend money. Just to do that. Well, you know what? Oh, you know what? I got a good idea. Um, yeah, I'll probably just plow through these, um, paywalls. Fuck that. Fuck this thing. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Okay, it's over. Dear shit. Fuck. Fuck. I want your money. Give me your money, sleepy time. Give me your fucking money. Shit. Alright, there. I just had to pull a hard left, but I did it. <laughs> okay, there we go. There we go. Stop, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Okay. So there we go. Oh, I remember hating this shit. I remember... Hating the hell out of this. Okay. Fuck. There. I'm gonna save Patrick's dream up until the end because. Fuck. There you go. Because not only do I want to get the teleport box, because I can just go back. Oh, yeah, right. You can just use the teleport box to go back. But anyway. We're gonna do that. Ay, 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 ay. Uh, actually, you know what? You want know to be more efficient on my end? Oh, yeah, okay, obviously I'm gonna... Oh, I hit him. Cool, cool. I want this slick dead because I want your money. There you go. Give me your money. Okay, so I have 2,000 left. This is basically every single thing up until here. Okay, I'm gonna go to Super Bounce because I'm pretty sure it would just lead me to either Squidward's or Sandy's dream. Okay, it leads me to Sandy's. Thank you. Thank you. Make me let me save time, okay? We got all that done in three minutes, okay? Three minutes. That's all it took. Oh, but there's paywalls in these levels. Okay. So basically, um, I found that this area lets you grind up so many goddamn shiny objects. Just doing that alone it gives you the sufficient amount of shiny objects. I mean, look at that. That's like almost a free thousand. Every time. So just throw yourself off that thing consistently, and there you go. Anyway, we're going to start getting through this area. You know, obviously collecting as most shiny objects as we possibly can, because there's another paywall on this level. Which also, there's diarrhea in this area. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized there's piles of diarrhea in this area. Yeah, I love the fact that there's just giant piles of shit here. There, oh my... Fine, 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 fine. Okay. Shut up. Okay. 
Oh, there's just one in each? Oh, thank God. So, I think this is the only paywall left. Okay, so, uh, now every, uh, shiny object counts towards Mr. Krabs. <laughs> now it does. Oh, come on. What the fuck? What are you supposed to do? I almost went to 300% speed again. But I don't feel like talking at 300% speed again, you know, because that's not, it's not fun. There we go. Area over. Actually, no, it's not. <laughs> Okay, so number one. Destroy this. Dear God, is it absolutely imperative to get rid of that stupid Duplicatotron. Come on! Come on, you piece of shit! There. There we go, we have over a thousand again. Thank you. There you go. Whoosh. Down, down, meow, meow. Okay, so now just hit the springboard and uh, they'll put you right back on track. Let's talk to Plankton again, see what he says. Yep. Couldn't have said it any better myself, Sheldon. Shit, I literally almost was... I was considering jumping off there. Oh, there's a sock up here. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll take all of those I can get. Errit. There you go. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, I hate these things. These cows. Dear fucking Jesus, I hate these cows. They throw pies at you. And it's the most fucking annoying thing. Okay, I'm gonna get a checkpoint here. Thank you. Kill, kill you, kill you, kill you. Yes, 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 yes. I'm pretty sure there's just a. I don't know if there's other socks in the dream worlds. I don't know what other socks there are. Whatever. Okay. Don't casproing me. There you go. Casproing? Is that even a thing? I would not like to be kasproinged. I think it might just be in your best interest to not be kasproinged. Thank you very much. Alright, I have no clue where the hell this leads. I don't know. I don't know, maybe I could beat the rest of Spongebob's dream, considering how well this is going. I mean, I knew this was the longest one, but still. Oh, because I died? You know what? That means the... Ouch, my ears, my ears. I'm gonna file this under hate and abuse against my ears. Oh, okay, there you go. Thank you. Yeah, you never thought a starry, a starry galaxy would be in the skull, inside of a cow's skull. Along with tasers and cows who throw buys at you. Fuck these cows, man. Fuck. These are the only cows in my life who've taken any offense towards me. 
And it's ridiculous. Okay, let's just speed this up. Boo, 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 boo. Okay, there, we're done. There you go. We almost have 80 golden spatulas. Honestly, you know what? I feel like just beating the rest of this area. Okay, there we go. And I'm gonna hit this up one more time. Boom. And I'll probably just do super bounce again. Yeah, because I just don't feel like doing that. So, whatever. So, uh, we're gonna be going to super bounce again. Because then we'll just instantly hop into Squidward's Dream. Because Squidward's Dream is not very fun. Yeah, basically three of these um, four dreams are not very fun. They aggravate me, actually. Okay, so let's go to Squidward's Dream. Let's just get Squidward's Dream over with. Squidward's Dream, because Sandy was one big slide. Oh, okay, there's a sock over there, but how many other socks are there? So anyway, you have to jump on a bunch of music notes. All of them want you dead. All of those uh, fall apart. I don't know if those are uh, spikes or whatever, but you don't want to get hit by those. Yeah, I took a choir class where they told me all this stuff, but I don't remember it. Sock is in a dickish location. I remember now. It's in a really douchey spot. Arg! Thank you. Okay, so you have to get up across this thing. Yeah, so. Yeah, drums and. Yeah, bongo drums and trumpets serve as springs. Which fucking A. Springs didn't need to... Basically, this area is just precision platforming. Just fuck you, precision platforming. You know, if you're, if you're not good at precision platforming, oh well. You know, that's what they... Oh, fuck. Why would you have springs and then fucking moving springs? Like, nobody does that. Like, first you have moving platforms, which are already annoying as shit. But then... Just, just to be an added douche, you have moving springs. Those are springs that don't care about you in any capacity. Okay. I have a feeling that um, there's no checkpoint here. Yeah. So either you take the risk of having to do all of that again, just to get a sock, which obviously I'm going to go for. Fuck it! Fuck it! There's only 20 socks left in this whole game, but I don't care. Because all of them were in areas that I missed and probably will feel stupid for. Well, I mean, some of them I didn't get out of sheer laziness, like Jellyfish Fields. I know one of them I didn't get because I just didn't feel like it. Okay. Arg! Arg! Oh, oh, no! What? What happened? I, oh, oh my god! I hate! Oh, this area is pure hate! No wonder it's annoying as shit. I think it's reflective of Squidward's personality. <laughs> I didn't get the teleport box. You know what? I don't care. Fuck. Oh, I shouldn't have spent my double jump. I shouldn't have spent it. Because it's just one fucking golden spatula, right? Yeah, there's just one golden spatula. So, literally... Like... Okay, so I know there's one sock in Mr. Krabs' dream. But where's the last one? It couldn't be in Sandy's again. Because, number one, I don't feel like going back there. But second... 
Okay, I thought I killed myself. Okay. There's no checkpoint, though, for this area. So. If you fuck this up... You're going all the way back. Mm, I hate all of this platforming they force you to do one right after the other. There's no way. There's no way I can get all of this done in one episode. There's no fucking way. I mean, because already, like, I have no clue where we're at. I have to pause. 15 minutes, and I'm barely even halfway there. I mean, just ugh. And then Mr. Krabs' dream is just a test of fucking patience. Ah! Fuck. Fucking... Why do I keep... Ah! I keep doing that for no reason. Literally, I just keep throwing myself off of platforms just because. Like, I don't even know why I'm doing it anymore. Like, it's a fucking... It's just stupid. No, you're just stupid. I knew I was going to hate this area. I knew. Even after, like, not playing it for so long, I was like... You know what? I've been through some hard things in this game. I don't think this is gonna be that bad. No! No! You know what I think I did? I think I fucked myself again. And no. no. Yes! Yes! Thank you. Thank fucking Christ on a hand basket. Okay. No! Stop! 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 Stop around! Thank you. It doesn't return you back, but just... Okay, yes. Thank you. I hate life. I hate it. But I got it done. Okay. Let's go grab this uh, shiny object right here. Thank you. <sighs> Fuck you, Squidward's nose. Okay. So I'm just gonna go back to Super Bounce again, but just because I don't feel like going back because I fucked up the teleport box. I mean, because dear god, there's practically no reason I would ever want to go back unless I wanted to grind, but why would I want to grind there of all? What the fuck? What the fuck? Alright. Whatever, I met Mr. Krabs' dream. If I could just get this done in a timely manner, we're Gucci. We're fucking Gucci. I can't escape. I can't escape work anywhere. There. So you have three Duplicatotrons, which all spawn different enemies. Uh, first, the floaty guys, the little common enemies. And fucking slicks. Mm hmm. Yeah, they force you to do that. Hmm, maybe there's not a sock. Actually, yes, there is. So, number one, you know... Oh, my God, I hate slicks. I fucking hate those things. Can I just refute the fact that I fucking hate slicks? Dear God. You want to get rid of the Duplicatotrons. So, I don't know what enemies respawn from those two. So that's my only strategy, is just sniping those two from range. Okay, let's see if either one respawn. No, it seems like the only one I got rid of was the uh, slick one. Probably because if I kill this slick, or not, I'll just die first. He'll come back. Okay, so I got rid of the slick one. There. Okay, so I got all the Duplicatotrons. 
Meaning I can. Oh god no. Oh my god, man, come the fuck on. Okay. Let's um. Let's get rid of that duplicate Ultron. These fucking piece of shit slicks can hit you from basically anywhere. Erg! Bitch. Bitcheroni. No! Thank you. You could probably go to this hellhole to grind shiny objects, but... Oh, fuck. Okay, I don't know why I let let him respawn, but fucking who gives a shit? Okay. No! No! I'm pretty sure there's a sock over here. Yes. Okay, there. I right, I didn't even get that uh, duplicate Tron yet. Please, don't fuck me. Okay. Boom. Alright, now all I have to deal with are two fucking slicks. Okay, thank god they're not multi-hit in this fucking area. Dear Jesus. Okay. Alright, on the third try or second? I don't know. Fuck it, I don't care. This place makes my blood boil. Like, I remember as a kid, I just I freaking despised this place. Of course I learned it, because I learned how to snipe those gosh dang uh, duplicatotrons, because I just didn't feel like wasting my time trying to do it any other way. Shit. Shit! Fuck, I hate... I hate... That kind of platforming is just fucking despicable. It's like the kind of platforming that just it forces you to be patient with everything, and yet you don't have the time to be fucking patient. Okay, Patrick's Dream. This one is the absolute funniest. Like, this is the funniest goddamn thing ever. It's one room with Patrick sitting in it. Check this out. Yep, it was literally right there. This is because um, there was concept for a Patrick's Dream level, but they couldn't finish it because of time constraints or something, so they just did this. Yep, Gary does in fact need another bath. So with that, we've beaten SpongeBob Dream! Uh, yeah. We, we did it all in one episode. Um, I did it quite faster than I thought it was gonna be. So, now, I believe the next episode, I'm probably gonna grind, uh, uh shiny objects off screen. You know, I'll probably have to crunch the numbers of, uh, Mr. Krabs' reward. Just to see, uh, what I could do with that. Because, uh, we have that. Because it's 3,000, then 3,500, then 4,000, 4,500, 5,000, 5,500, and 6,500, and then 7,500? I'm pretty sure. I don't know. That means you need, like, 20,000 some odd shiny objects, but whatever. I don't care. I'm gonna use cheat codes for that, because I don't care, you know. There, there's no reason for that. So, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I should just go back to uh, that. But anyway, I'm gonna do that probably have the game on like 500 like a thousand percent speed and just keep blazing through it over and over and over and over again just grab all those uh, gold spatulas and then at that point would be the um sock grabathon, which i'd probably do like half the levels so jellyfish fields downtown bikini bottom goo lagoon uh mermalair and sand mountain 
nah. It would probably just be Mermelair, Goolagoon, Downtown Bikini Bottom, and Jellyfish Fields. And then another and then the finale would be Sand Mountain, Kelp Forest, Flying Dutchman's Graveyard, and SpongeBob's Dream, and then finishing the game. Which at that or actually then I would have to get the Patrick Golden Spatulas and then finish the game. So, at that point, I believe we are all set and ready to go to finally finish this game. So, next time on Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom, we are going to get the Mr. Krabs Golden Spatulas and start hunting for, for the missing socks. I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.